Where can you get Starbucks for more than half off? Wheat Thins for 50 cents a box due to slightly damaged packaging or Cheerios at a major discount because they're just past their expiration date. More consumers are flocking to outlets like this one, B&E Salvage Groceries on Preston Highway. Store owner Red Hartford tells us why. We have 2,000 to 3,000 people a day in this one store. Dates on food are not regulated by the federal government and scarcely regulated by states. Rather, they indicate peak quality, not danger of any kind of microbial contamination, with the exception of a small group of foods like dairy products and deli meats. Consumers throw them away, up to $2,000 worth of food annually, according to a new Harvard study. When you see these foods on the shelves of B&E Salvage, or perhaps a flea market, they've come from brokers who purchase the goods from major retailers like Kroger. It's good, good food, good quality. I like a lot of the fruits and the canned goods. It's like Big Lots. When we originally started, we wanted to call our place Little Lots. This is Jerry Downs for the Courier Journal.